Mrs. Honeybee. Today, we'll be exploring the world of Among Us. All you have to do is close your eyes, get cozy, and listen to the sound of my voice. Mrs. Honeybee will be your guide. Let's begin. You are here in a spaceship floating through outer space in your bright green spacesuit. The twinkling stars that appear to blink on and on are the only thing you see outside the windows. You are weightless here in outer space with the nine other crewmates aboard this spaceship on a mission to get back to Earth. Looking at each crewmate, you know that at least one of them is an alien imposter. So you study each and every one of them carefully in their brightly colored spacesuits. Orange looks sus, so you look at that crewmate twice. This is a very special game of Among Us because you have a special gift, one that allows you to see and understand more than the average crewmate and even the imposters. One that allows you to activate ghost mode whenever you so choose. The way to activate this special ghost mode is to take a slow, deep breath in through your nose. Hold the air in your rounded out chest for five, four, three, two, one. Then breathe all the way out through your mouth in five little breaths until your chest is back to its regular size. Now you've activated on-demand ghost mode. Your ghost self has floated out of your crewmate self for the moment. You can see everything around you rather than just directly ahead and you can move through the walls. More importantly, this special ghost mode will allow you to spy on other crewmates that you think might be imposters. Float through the wall over there and see what the orange crewmate is doing now. Orange seems to be doing the common task to swipe cards. Just to make sure Orange hasn't ousted themselves as an imposter, you check to make sure you have the common task to swipe card as well. And you do. Orange seems to be doing the task in the right order, but you continue to watch. To get back into your crewmate body and help them complete tasks to help keep the ship afloat, Take five little breaths in through your nose. Hold your breath in your chest for five, four, three, two, one. Then slowly breathe out in one steady exhale. Now you're back in your bright green spacesuit and ready to work with your crewmates. The first task is to upload data and you're on the Polis map. To complete this task, first you navigate to the download panel, which is in the office. You head in that direction, walking through the puzzling maze of the spaceship, down long halls and around corners. You suddenly sense that someone is walking near you. You look behind you and see Orange standing further down the hall and heading in your direction. Orange sees you and waves suspiciously. You continue forward and enter the office. The download panel is just on the other side of the two wood desks. You quickly get to it and download the data. On your way out of the office, Orange passes right by you to download data as their task. It seems curious, but you continue on your way to communications to upload data, navigating back through all the twisting 
and turning hallways. When you get to communications, you upload data and complete the task. That's when you hear someone walking behind you again. It's the orange crewmate again, and they are heading to upload data. Since they are so suspicious, you decide to activate on-demand ghost mode again, just to get a good look at what they do next. Take a slow, deep breath in through your nose. Hold the air in your rounded out chest for five, four, three, two, one. Then breathe out all through your mouth in five little breaths until your chest is back to its regular size. Now you're in ghost mode and immediately float into the wall beside the panel in the communications room where Orange is heading to upload data. Sure enough, here they come. They upload data as you follow their every move. Once they're done, they turn around and seem to be going on to the next task, a long one this time. They seem to be fixing weather nodes for this, so you follow them to the exterior of the spaceship. In on-demand ghost mode, you float through the wall and even through the walls of the spaceship to float weightlessly into outer space. The suspicious orange crewmate works diligently to solve the puzzles and adjust the weather mode. Having watched Orange for a while, you're starting to think that maybe you thought wrong of them. Maybe Orange is just a crewmate after all. You decide to switch back into your crewmate self just out of Orange's view. Take five little breaths in through your nose until you cannot take in any more air. Hold your breath in for five, four, three, two, one. Then slowly breathe out in one steady exhale. Now you're back in your bright green spacesuit as a crewmate. Just then, Orange rounds the corner, sees you, and waves before heading back to the office. You head back to the office to perform your next task, and that's when you notice something curious. Out of the side of your vision, as discreetly as you can, you watch Orange as they walk back to the download panel in the office. As a diligent crewmate, you know that the only reason Orange would be walking to the download panel is as the first stage to the upload data task, which they supposedly already did. And further, you also know that a crewmate can only be assigned that task once. You were right, Orange is the alien imposter. Before you call an emergency meeting to alert the other crewmates, take a slow, deep breath in through your nose and out through your mouth to steady your focus. Then you call an emergency meeting and the entire crew arrives at the table. You recount what you saw tracking Orange. In a last ditch effort to sabotage, Orange dies for the lights to try to sabotage the ship, but your detective work was solid and the crewmates instantly vote to eject Orange. When they're ejected, it's revealed that they were the alien imposter and that there was only one aboard. You did it. You saved the mission. Thanks to your special on-demand ghost mode and your keen eye, you were able to notice an imposter faking a long task when no one else did. Now all you have to do is sit back and relax all the way back to Earth, where you will be celebrated as the crewmate that saved the mission. You look out the window of the spaceship into the vast, 
peaceful outer space full of twinkling stars. Right before you doze off to sleep for a space nap, you see a fiery shooting star burst through space. That's a lucky shooting star just for you to make a wish on. Great job ousting the imposter crewmate. If you enjoy my stories, consider becoming a member of the Honey Bee Library. Being a Honey Bee Library member gives you access to hundreds of exclusive bedtime stories not available on my podcast. The Honey Bee Library has hundreds of bedtime stories just like this one, with new stories added every Sunday. See the description below to become a member of the Honey Bee Library. Always remember that Mrs. Honey Bee believes in you. You are special and you are loved. I can't wait to see you again.